Hi there, I'm Andy Hillier and today I'm going to teach you how to play Take Yourself Home by Troy Sivan. Uh, just before I do, if you wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel, which is Andy Hillier, if you could give me a like on the video and some comments in the comment section. Okay, so basically there's four bars that go through the whole um, song. We need to put a capo on the third fret. Standard tuning, but capo on the third fret. Okay, so it sounds like this. So let's learn it. Starts with the first finger on E1 and second finger on B1, third finger on D2 and little finger on G2. And make sure you're not touching the E string. We want the E string string nearest the floor to be open. So we're gonna play the E string, or actually both E strings at the same time, and then G and then B. So you've got and then it goes to your thumb down to the A, uh, to the D string, and you play the D string and the E string at the same time. And then play the G and then the B. So you've got the first bar. The next bar starts the same, but then we go back to another hit on the E string and the G string. So the second bar, um, from the beginning of the second bar goes. And then the second half of the bar is the same as the first half of the first bar. Hopefully that makes sense. So the whole of the first two bars slowly go. And then we go up to the seventh fret, but remember you've got a capo on. So the seventh fret is where the tenth fret normally is. And all we need to hold down is third finger on G7 second finger on D7 and we play the E string and the G string at the same time and then you're going to play the D string and then B so you got it does that twice in that bar the next bar is a similar sort of thing the second bar had an extra skip in so you play uh, the E string and the G string then the D string B and then E and D at the same time and then E and G at the same time and then there's a little change there it goes to fret 6 with the first finger on the D string D6 so the last bar the fourth bar goes and there's just an open E string on the end um, let's try and put the whole thing together nice and slowly ready and And that just repeats round a little bit faster. And then you just gotta build it up quicker and quicker for the song. Well, hopefully you've enjoyed that little lesson. If you have, if you wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel, I'm Andy Hillier. Uh, I'd really appreciate that. If you could give me some comments in the comment section, let me know what you thought of it. Let me know any songs you want me to do, or just say hi, let me know where in the world you're from, that'd be amazing. Uh, I think that's it, give me a like on the video. Thanks for watching this, I've been Andy Hillier, and I'll see you next time.